And your first alert forecast, we finally warmed things up, but the rain is coming back at us. A little different from last week where we had alert days for three days in a row. This time, the rain looks a little more gentle in nature until we get to Thursday. That'll be your big weather day. So as you can see from the Maryland Science Center camera, clouds are here. Now it's just a waiting game for the rain. We'll see some showers developing. They'll be scattered hit or miss once here this evening. Tonight, we'll see a widespread batch while you sleep, and some of those will linger into the morning commute tomorrow. That will slow things down. So budget yourself some extra time. You know what happens when the roads are wet and we have the situation that we are in with the key bridge not being in place. So as we look at Thursday, late day heavy thunderstorms likely and then Friday, windy, cool, showery. Next headline, we have a really nice weekend on the way. A lot of you reporting either you're suffering from the allergies or it's just coating your cars. And so you will get a free car wash here later this week. But that is going to be a problem here through probably tomorrow with the high levels of tree pollen, maple, the main culprit. Live sweeping radar, nice and quiet. 57 will be your bottom number of the night tonight. So we're not going to be that cool. Showers possible, yeah, during the overnight hours uh, and temperatures that don't cool off too much. So no heavy jacket tomorrow morning. Have the umbrella here after 7 o'clock this evening. Some scattered showers will develop, especially after 10 o'clock. You can see this wave. No oranges or red, so no severe weather here, but there could be a clap of thunder in some spots as this warm front lifts to the north, and then tomorrow afternoon looks pretty nice with temperatures in the low 70s. So let's go into your neighborhood for tomorrow. We're talking about Baltimore County here. 73 degrees tomorrow in Freeland, 77 Owings Mills, Catonsville, you'll be 78 degrees, 76 in Timonium. As we move up to Cecil County, you'll be 72 Charlestown tomorrow, 72 Fair Hill, rising sun, 72 degrees. Kent County, over on the eastern shore, low to mid 70s, beautiful day tomorrow after we get rid of those morning showers. So that's certainly some good news. If you didn't see your county, we'll hear all of our county. So from Harford County over into Carroll County, temperatures in the 70s tomorrow afternoon. Anne Arundel County, low 70s, and most of our eastern shore counties in the low to mid 70s. Here's that heavy batch of rain, showers, and storms that we'll be tracking. Just a slight chance of strong storms, but the bigger concern on Thursday will be some heavier rain. So 75 degrees on your Wednesday. Thursday's the day that we have the potential of some heavier rain. We have a level two out of three threat for the possibility of some flash flooding. So we'll watch that 64 on Friday, Saturday, a very windy day, Sunday, the easier outdoor day at 76, and then a big fat 80 degrees coming up here for Monday. Guys, over to you. See, thank you. Nikki